Hello everybody and welcome to Ancient Architects. It's not often I do a news update, but under the tree canopies in the jungles of northern Guatemala, tens of thousands of structures built by the Maya over a millennium ago have been found. Not far from the sites tourists already know, like the towering temples of the ancient city of Tikal, laser technology has uncovered around 60,000 homes, palaces, tombs and even highways in the humid lowlands. The landscape is thought to have been home to millions more people than other research had previously suggested. The researchers mapped over 810 square miles in northern Petan. And archaeologists believe the cutting-edge technology will change the way the world views the Maya civilization. How it works is that lasers are shot down from planes to pierce through the thick foliage of the forest to paint a 3D picture of the ground below. The technology is called light detection and ranging, or LIDAR. The dense tree canopy was digitally removed, so we could see what was under the surface of the now uninhabited Guatemalan rainforest. And it truly is spectacular. Francisco Estrada Belli, a Tulan University archaeologist, told National Geographic magazine that they'll need around 100 years to go through all the data and to really understand what they're seeing. At its peak, around 1,500 years ago, the Maya civilization covered an area around twice the size of medieval England, with an estimated population of around 5 million. But with the new data, it's no longer unreasonable to think there was somewhere around 10 to 15 million people living there, including many living in the low-lying swampy areas that many archaeologists thought were uninhabitable. Most of the 60,000 newly identified structures are thought to be stone platforms that would have supported the average pole and thatch Maya home. The archaeologists were struck by the incredible defensive features which included walls, fortresses and moats, and they showed that the Maya invested more resources into defending themselves than previously thought. Most spectacularly is that one of the finds is a seven-story pyramid, so covered in vegetation that it practically melts into the jungle. Another discovery that surprised archaeologists was a complex network of causeways linking all of the Maya cities in the area. The raised highways allowed easy passage even during the rainy seasons and were wide enough to suggest they were heavily trafficked and used for trade. The project has so far cost around $600,000 but it isn't just about protecting the cultural treasures. The project is part of a broad push to fight climate change, generate tourism dollars and prevent illegal activities like border trafficking and deforestation in the protected areas. The amazing thing about this site is that it is completely untouched and as many other ancient sites have been destroyed by later human activity, this one is completely different. The Maya abandoned their empire in AD 900 and the jungle grew over the abandoned fields and structures. It hid them but it also conserved them and nobody has seen them since. In the past the jungle has always hindered archaeological discoveries but this time it has acted as a great preservation tool and now we're about to uncover some breathtaking new discoveries that will literally change history. Thank you very much for watching this news update from Ancient Architects. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe to the channel, please like this video and please leave a comment below. Thank you very much.